Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to quickly show how you can solve the issue of playing metahuman head animations on top of other body animations. The common scenario you may be familiar with is when you play animations in game where you have head and neck movement, it's supposed to play on top of the body, but the head gets this location offset. Why? Well, it's because the neck and head have transform data. If you search the wide ranges of the internet, climb the tallest towers of forums, whatever you can find involves opening sequencer, doing some mumbo jumbo with control rigs, until today. So I found the simplest solution that you can easily apply to the point where you're going to cry tears of joy. I'm using my asset, the dialog component, to play a body animation and a face animation on this metahuman character. I recorded myself doing some exaggerated movements for demonstration purposes, and if I play this by default, you'll see the issue that I'm talking about. We get the body and the face animation playing, but the head disconnects. So here's the solution. Simply open the animation sequence, change additive to mesh space, skeleton reference pose, and run this bad boy again. Boom. Just like that, we get the full head rotation and movement playing on top of the body. Let's throw another body animation here. Boom. It works. I know. I know. Where have I been this whole time? Anyway, I hope you found this helpful. If you did, consider giving me a sub, a like, and I'll see you in the next one. Late.